Hey everyone, welcome back. So this is the another most important scenario based Power BI interview question that has been asked by the interviewer of the CGI during the recruitment process of Power BI developer job role. Okay. So before moving into the question, let me show you the data set that I have already imported into this Power BI desktop environment and that is called as the India population. Okay. And if you want to see what exactly this table contain, here you can see this particular table contain two column. One is the state column and this is the population column. It means it indicates the total population for each state. Suppose these are the only state that is present inside the India country. So now out of these two columns, we have to calculate the, the total populations of India with the help of DEX function in Power BI. But remember, during calculations of the total population of India, we have to exclude the populations of Maharashtra, Gujarat and Karnataka. Okay, so write a DEX functions by the help of which we can achieve this. This is the requirement. Okay, so let's see how we can do this. So for that, first of all, we have to create one calculated measure on this particular table and that is total population of India. So to do that, just right click on this particular table, then click on new measure, then rename it as total underscore population, then equal to, and here we will use one DEX function that is called as the calculate, because our requirement is we have to calculate the total population of India, right? So here we will use the DEX functions that is called as the calculate to calculate the total population. And this calculate DEX functions take two arguments. One is the expression part and next is the filter part. So in place of expression, we will use another DEX functions that is called as the sum. And inside this sum DEX functions, we will pass the population column of the India underscore population table. Okay. So just click here, then click enter. Then close the bracket and again close the bracket. Then click enter. And now here you can see we have successfully created one measure called as the total population, right? And if you want to see it in a graph form, then just click on this particular card visual. And inside this card visual, just drag this particular measure and drop it over here. All right. So as you can see here, our total population is 10 million. All right. And if you want to see it's in exact value, then just click over here, then click on collide value. And here in place of auto, just click on none. And here you can see it is showing the exact population of India. All right. But now our requirement is during calculations of this total population, we want to exclude the population of Maharashtra, Gujarat and Karnataka. Right. So how we can do that? For that, again, click on this particular measure that we have created. Right. So as you already know, this particular measure is giving the total populations of India, right? But our requirement is during calculation of the total populations, we have to exclude the population of Maharashtra, Gujarat and Karnataka, right? So for that, first just remove this close bracket, okay? Then give the comma over here to give the filter value from this total population, okay? And we want to filter the populations of Maharashtra, Gujarat and Karnataka from this total value, right? So here we will use another DEX function that is called as the NOT and then open the bracket. All right. And inside this bracket, we will pass the state column of this particular India underscore population table. So here we will write state. Okay. And this is the state column of this particular table. Right. So just click enter. All right. Then here again, we will use another DEX functions that is called as the in text function. Okay. And here we will open the curly bracket and we will close the curly bracket. And inside this curly bracket, we will write the name of those state whose populations we want to exclude from the total population. And remember the name of this particular state should be exactly same, whatever the name is present inside this state column. And this name should be present inside the double quotation by the separations of comma like this okay here you can see these are the state name maharashtra gujarat and karnataka because we want to exclude the populations of these three states from this total population so that's why here we have to write the name of those state whose population we want to exclude from the total population okay then close the bracket 
and again close the bracket for this calculate dex function then click enter and now here you can see 10 millions has been changed to 66 lakh right so this is the total populations of india if you will exclude the population of maharashtra gujarat and karnataka all right and if you want to check whether the value is correct or not then what you have to do just click on this table visual okay and inside this table visual just drag the state name and the population column all right and if you will add the total population of this state then the value should be this one but if you will exclude the populations of Maharashtra, Karnataka and Gujarat from this total value the value will come as the 66 lakh here you can calculate easily right so in this way we will calculate the total population of India by the help of DEX function in Power BI by excluding the populations of Maharashtra, Gujarat and Karnataka alright so thanks for watching take care bye bye